How's my life? Do we like new lighting setup? Are we enjoying this? Do we like this? Let me know down in the comments. Hello! Welcome to my channel. And it was requested that I do a video on books that I strictly bought because of the cover art. So, as requested, here it is. As I said, this is this video is going to be completely dedicated to books that I bought strictly based on the book cover. We all know that we shouldn't judge books by their cover. I'm judging them by their cover because... But these are books that I have not read at all yet and hopefully they are good. I really hope so. Just because their covers are amazing. Alrighty, so the first book that I'm going to talk about is When Life Happens by Jewel E. Ann. And can we just talk about how stunning these cover, this cover is? Because of the colors, it pops out at you and I love that it's like ballerina legs and or maybe it's ballerina legs I think it is but it looks really really just enticing and I've been seeing this around my circle in the book community people have said that they like this book so I was like I'm gonna give it a chance because it has an amazing cover it's absolutely gorgeous to me and the next book I'm going to talk about is A Pound of Flesh by Sophie Jackson. So this cover, I have actually been waiting for this book to come out so that I could complete the series, so that I could start reading the series, but I definitely love this cover. This cover is for book number one, and it's just hands, and it's in black and white, and it's just like, I want to know the story of why those hands are not completely connected, and why they are just looking like I, I have a story to tell. So that is why I bought this book. Up next, we have Up in the Tree House by K.K. Allen. And this book, it has all these earthy elements to it that it looks like you're sitting on the bottom of that tree. And of course, the title is another thing that drew me in because it has a tree on it and you're looking from the bottom of the tree all the way up and it's just like what's up there is this going to be a mystery is this going to be a romance and I'm pretty sure it says that it's a romance but I did find out that there is a second book so I don't know if it's going to be a duet or a trilogy but still I think this is just an amazing cover and I definitely bought it just because of the cover. So next we have Life Interrupted by Yessi Smith and this book is looks like it's going to be a dark sort of mystery it's ladies legs running on dark pavement and it looks like she's running away from something i want to know what she's running away from is that a good thing or is that a bad thing it just looks all kinds of dark and twisted and you guys know i love my dark and twisted sometimes all right next books we have is a series it's called the evolution of sin series and it includes the affair the secret the consequence when you look at these they're beautiful in my eyes first you have book one which has a set of legs are colored and they have this like landscaping in the back and i just want to know why the legs why the landscape in the back and it looks like sort of parasy and it just really really intrigued me it was like yes i kind of need to know it really caught my eye and it's vibrant colors on this dark background so it's really really beautiful the second book is the secret and the secret is of a male stomach with another landscape on it so of course it has a hot guy's belly on there and all kinds of abs and craziness so it's like yeah maybe this book is going to be sexy maybe this is a continuation of a love story that happened in book number one especially with the title of the affair and then we have the you know this title of the secret it's just craziness and then book number three is the consequence yeah we have a lady's back with another landscape and vibrant colors on a back on a black screen in the back and it's just like you need to know what happened throughout the secret and the affair to know what the consequences really are so let's talk about what lies beyond the stars by michael gorgian last said that name right this is a butterfly and the butterfly has like this 
differentness about it to me. It's butterfly on one side and then it goes sort of mechanical. I think I was looking at something else that was in the sci-fi genre and this book cover caught my eye and I was like I gotta know if this has anything to do with that whole evolutionary thing that goes along with if a butterfly flaps its wings on one side of the earth there could be a hurricane or a tsunami on the other side of the earth. Yes I need to, I needed this book and needed this story because of course I needed some more sci-fi in my life because I don't have very much sci-fi. I'm not a big sci-fi person but then I could be completely wrong and not know if this is sci-fi or not. We're gonna find out sooner or later. Next is Sexual Awakenings by Kate Stewart. Kate has been my dark horse and I just couldn't resist this cover could not resist this cover. This cover is in that black and gold and when I get finally get my hands on a copy of this because I'm gonna be stalking Kate now because I've now read a couple of her books that have just put me over the top and I just need to like get some of her other books. So yes I will be stalking her to try and get her books but this book it looks like it's gonna be like flashy and vibrant and just beautiful and it's intriguing and from what I know about it it's dark and it's taboo and I think I'm going to love it love it love it so now we have the delivery by Mara White this oh my goodness this tells nothing that I know of about this story I can't even remember what it was that it that I loved about this so much besides the fact that it's an ink spot on a black like cover with some other colors on there it's so intriguing it just kind of drew me in and I must have been in one of my mystery suspense sort of head spaces and was like yes I sort of need this it probably was also on sale so I was like I need this even more in my life because this cover is amazing so amazing next we have a second hand lie and a second hand life by pamela crane and this is the killer thriller series so i'm pretty sure there's going to be another book so i must have been in a headspace of wanting to have thrillers that were romantic this cover is of people's backs and intertwined couples and of course it's a thriller so there might be some mind twisting going on and i really am looking forward to it really looking forward to it next up is royal atlas by h j bullis and i most definitely was in a cowboy sort of mood i don't know if the story is about cowboys but this cover is of a yummy yummy man with a horse so it screams cowboy to me and i just had to have it had to have it because every once in a while i just want to read about a cowboy and some romance and some love and I know it goes along with the series because the other books along in this series they may be standalone books in a series but I just had to have it because it's so sexy and yummy yes it is so I thought I had one more book but obviously I didn't so those are the books that I bought strictly because of the covers aren't they all gorgeous don't they make you go want to go out and like buy them I thought so that's why I did. Let me know down in the comments if you guys have read any of those books and what you thought about them. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, there is a feedback form in the description box so you guys can help me improve my channel. I started a Goodreads group, so go check that out as well. Thank you for watching, and we will see you guys later.